A Kelowna resident has a new lease on life after receiving not one, but two liver transplants. Matt Gaif was in liver failure back in 2000 due to an autoimmune disease. Doctors told him he had only six months to live, but thankfully within four months, an anonymous donor stepped forward. It would have passed away 24 years ago. It was an anonymous donor. I know what city it came out of. Uh, nurse, when she had come in, she goes, good news, the plane just arrived from Saskatoon. In 2020, Scaife received a second transplant after his autoimmune disease began to impact the second liver. He says having been close to death twice has given him a new perspective. So you have to literally go and live your life. And I used to have a list of things that I would someday do, but it was always someday. Oh, someday I'd love to do this or someday I'd love to do that. Well, that changed after my first liver transplant. Now it's about living and doing. The 63-year-old has been on a flying trapeze and gone barefoot water skiing. Becoming a donor takes roughly two minutes online. So many people take good health for granted. And it's when you don't have it and it's been given back to you that you realize, I'm going to change how I've been thinking. I'm going to change how I live my life. And I'm going to go and have fun. A record-breaking 563 people received organ transplants in 2023, thanks to the generosity of 160 deceased organ donors in their families and 77 living donors. For Castanet News, I'm Madison Reeve in Kelowna.